Well, a big night tonight for Theatre Bristol. It is opening night for the Susification of Romeo and Juliet. Here with more now on what we can expect during these performances are Zaya Gray, who plays Romeo, and we've got Cooper Knapp here with us as well, one of the other cast members. Great to have you guys. Opening night, are we excited? Oh, yes, yeah. ma'am. Are you ready? Like, I feel like after all the rehearsals and it's like, Usually we're still nervous always, but definitely ready. Mm -hmm. It's always fun when it opens. Let's talk a little bit about this production. You're playing Romeo mm -hmm. and it's the Susification. So kind of like, I guess if he had his way with the script, it would be a little bit different. Tell mm -hmm. me a little bit about it. So uh, it follows the same you know, plot of Romeo and Juliet, but you will find some Susified themes, right? So it's going to be green eggs and ham, you know, uh, fox and socks that type of stuff. So, which I think always lends itself to, it's gotta be interesting trying to, when you're memorizing all of this, with all the Dr. Seuss sort of language and vocabulary, what's that been like trying to remember? It's just, it's so witty. It's really just about intuition. I mean, it all rhymes, so it's basically like memorizing a rap song. It's just matching the words. Matching the words. Mm -hmm. And how does the, I mean, making that with the comedy and the fun with Romeo and Juliet, which is, of course, that tragic love story. <laughs> What's that like pulling all of that together when you guys first kind of read the script and saw it play out? What was that oh, like? Oh, it was, it was very funny to read at first. You know, there, there are a lot of very funny moments, um, which I'm not going to spoil it. You okay. know, you got to come find that out. <laughs> <laughs> How about for you? First, first reaction when reading through the script? Oh, it's hysterical it's so like goofy and out there which the original story Romeo and Juliet is out there and goofy mm -hmm. but this one just takes it to a whole new level Wonderful. it's really enjoyable and you guys have both been with theater Bristol for several years now what's mm -hmm. it like being part of this theater company it's so nice such a good community like everybody there is just awesome to work with and just great people you said you kind of grew up in the theater mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been doing shows there for as long as I can remember. Started maybe six years old, roughly. Been doing around over 55 shows now. So. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and this time playing Romeo, what's that yeah. like? Uh, you know, I, I, I didn't think I would get to this place, I guess. But, you know, it's, it's fun. It's awesome. I get to be the cocky guy who, you know, heartthrob. I love it. I'm excited. <laughs> and I love that it's the Susification. Everybody knows Romeo and Juliet, but this will be such a different take on mm -hmm. it to be able to see that play out on stage. Well, best of luck tonight. I know it's going to be great. We'll give everybody some information. Tickets are on sale now for the Susification of Romeo and Juliet. There are the dates this weekend and again next weekend. And of course, all happening there at Theatre Bristol in downtown Bristol.